hello everyone uh, welcome to this new video in this video we are going to talk about temporary table spaces and previously we had a discussion about uh, uh, table spaces where we have created table spaces and add data files over there and resizes also and change uh, we have changed the data file names everything we have done so uh, in this video we are going to create temporary table space and we'll be adding temporary te data data i mean temp file to the temporary table spaces but before that as usual why do we need temporary table spaces because whenever users are executing any kind of queries either in that query it may be uh, any sorting operations any joining operations any kind of set operations so it requires a temporary space either to sorting or joining everything so because of that we need a temporary space where we can perform or oracle database can perform their task right So, uh, this is the syntax to create a temporary table space. We all already discussed about this uh, syntax while creation of data files, right? So here, some of some of the keywords will be changed, like create temporary. We uh, previously we were using only table space, right? But here, as we have explicitly creating temporary table spaces, so we have to. Uh, mention this temporary table space and the table space name and we are adding temp file so we had a discussion about the table space that to create a table space at least one either data file or temp file should be there right so we are mentioning one temp file and here we are mentioning the size initial size and we are telling if required auto extend yourself how much you will be auto extend yourself by 512 kb but what is the max size you can uh, you can take right so we are specifying 200 mb let us create it, this table space so temporary table space has been created yes from where we can see tba temp files so now we have created one temporary table space with this data file a temp file so what if we have we want to add one more temp file to this temporary table space so for that we are we will be using the same thing as we have already uh, added data files to table spaces so alter table space table space name add temp file and the temp file we are mentioning here size 50 mb and same thing right so So here it is. Yeah. So this is how we can add temporary table space or temp file, and uh, we can create different table space, temporary table spaces. But why? Why do we need? different temporary table spaces in our next video we are going to talk about temporary table space groups and we'll be explaining this question right so see you in the next video